Our small startup program in urologic oncology at Providence St. John's Cancer Institute is small but mighty. We offer a state-of-the-art, academic level, cutting edge, urologic cancer program and urologic cancer services to the city of Santa Monica and West Los Angeles. We have a whole spectrum of agents available for treatment of advanced urological tumors, including immune drugs that activate patients' own immune system to fight cancer, hormonal agents, particularly in prostate cancer, and also chemotherapeutics. Our small academic center offers the best uh, and the latest in what's available in image-guided prostatectomy and partial nephrectomy with using technology known as SEVRA, uh, real-time 3D imaging during surgery. Before we were always looking at 2D images and basically using our mind to recreate this 3D picture in our head, the picture that we were going to operate on, the tumor that we were going to remove, where the blood vessels were, where the nerves were. But the 3D imaging took a lot of the guesswork out of that, enables us to spend more time planning the surgery and what we were going to do interoperatively instead of trying to figure out where the tumor was or where were the blood vessels in relation. The patients are always shocked at seeing where their tumor is, where it's located in the kidney, how close it is to the vessels, how close it is to the nerves, and what are things that I might have to do interoperatively to get them the best results. And I think when they understand that, it, it essentially builds trust between us. We now have more methods available using buccal mucosal grafts, as well as other options that we can provide for patients that can allow them to have minimally invasive surgery but still get great outcomes. We have the latest in focal therapy technology with the Focal One machine where we can essentially just destroy the cancer and leave everything else intact. St. John's was the first adapter of the Focal One system. And what's unique about Focal One, unlike the other high foods that came before it, is that it's a truly robotic system once you are able to program where you're going to do the ablation, then the system essentially takes over and you can get exactly where your targets are and fuse your MRs with what you're seeing in real-time ultrasound. So we're really able to do a truly focal procedure um, that previously was unable to be done. More importantly, because we're just treating the area that has the cancer, we actually leave the prostate intact. So that's one of the huge benefits of focal therapy is that you're no longer dealing with some of the known side effects of radical prostatectomy because the prostate itself is left alone and you're just treating the area that has the cancer. This lab, Department of Translational Molecular Medicine, main purpose is develop molecular diagnostic assays, be it in body fluids, looking at cell-free nucleic acids, circulating tumor cells, and then in tissue, looking at uh, unique genes as predictors or prognostic factors. So one of the important aspects is we develop molecular diagnostics, be it pure molecular or epigenetic, so-called, or genomic. And we do it for early detection. Primary, we've oriented to surgical oncology for surgical, before and after surgical resection to monitor patients. But we also involved in many clinical trials, past and present, to monitor patients who are receiving therapies. One example of clinical trial that we currently have in progress utilizes lutetium-177 PSMA in patients with newly diagnosed metastatic prostate cancer. This is an application of this compound in much earlier setting when it's currently applied and we are very excited to be able to offer this to our patients. At our Cancer Institute, um, the heart and soul of our program really is our urologic oncology and robotics fellowship. Uh, we offer one and two year training opportunities for fully trained urologists uh, to spend more time learning about minimally invasive surgery with an emphasis on robotics and urologic cancer. Um, they spend time in Dr. Twardowski's tumor boards uh, that happens monthly discussing the latest treatments for all kinds of urologic malignancy. Even though we're a cancer institute associated and affiliated with a community hospital, we're offering the latest cutting edge treatments offered at the best uh, centers around the world. 
The blessing of working at Providence St. John's Cancer Institute has been you still have this world-renowned Cancer Institute feeling, but in a small center where you're working together very closely with medical oncologists, radiation oncologists, even in different specialties, which has enhanced my knowledge of other cancers, other diseases, and allowed me to take better care of my patients.